next is just trying to, again, look at the, the layout of your drawing and the composition with the theme that's there. And when you take a look at this first uh, character, kind of having the rounded, almost a front, front view, kind of placing it in there, circular section for this piece. So that's going to give you, again, that beginning part with the nose. The cheeks are there, but then they're stretched out to one direction. There's the bridge of the nose, so it shows the eye location. So I'm just going to keep it with just the eye this time. And it's kind of a loose sketch, and then it has the bigger patch on there. And again, these two shapes, they could just kind of blend together, just like clay, just kind of forcing themselves together. There's a center line for this part. <coughs> There's a triangular shape for the mouth but it does arch itself, curve, and it bends itself that way, so you can get the, the curve in there. The eyes are a little half-masked with the lids, so that's just a elliptical shape around it, and it places the pupil right in, inside there, and the triangular part for the nose as it arches itself off with the highlight, so you can kind of get a pretty quick gestural sketch in there, the ears are just going straight up with a bend. And same on this side. Here it is straight up with a bend. And then everything else becomes rounded off into this section. And it kind of tapers itself. So when you think of the theme and how you're going to lay out the composition, let that be part of it. And that kind of gets you, get you started. So you kind of have a pretty quick beginning and see if you can't get the, uh, the layout in there for that section. So try it on there. Mm-hmm. 